The e blocks, 124 that were started, only 23 has dedicated funds. 23 from secondary education improvement project. Mm -hmm. It has dedicated funds. It was easy to execute, even though about 13 of them had been completed when we took over. The rest of it, the money was there. So it was just managing to make sure you finished. All the rest, there were no dedicated budget source, which we can do these days. <laughs> these days you can't. Uh, any project that you're going to do, you have to make sure in education, there's money set aside. But during their time, they did something that has led to this crisis of some people saying, my e-block has not been done. The 23 that had budget allocation has not been completed because their money was set aside for it. So for the ones that there wasn't money, have you found new money to finish? No, no, of course. We've been com in fact, a number of them has been financed, and I did a report on the floor of parliament, a number of them have been financed with the bond money from the 1.5 billion that we sought uh, from Parliament, sought approval for Parliament. So, so a number of them have been completed. This year we're going to open some of them. But the bottom line is that if you don't have the money sitting there and you are doing the whole construction, the way I always say, my father cocoa farmer built his house. Every year you have some cocoa and you dry and you take some money and then you add on. That's how we do education. So. When you do it that way, it's difficult to mm. complete it in a timely fashion. So when people say, why are you not, why are you not doing this? My question is, we, 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 we really did bite more than we can chew. So what do you make of the, the complaints by teachers about the one laptop, one teacher project? Uh, the, the bottom line for me is that they've been given a device that has a full complement of any other device you can find on the market mm -hmm. in terms of the memory size in terms of speed. You see, when you, I taught uh, ICT mm -hmm. in high school in the US. So I know a bit about computers. And the most important thing to me, any computer that I'm holding in my hand, I'm going to look at the speed, the megahertz, and I'm going to look at the memory. And I'm going to look at what am I going to do with this device? And will this device enable me to do the work that I'm supposed to do? Once the answers are in the affirmative, I'm, I'm good with the device. So, so the bottom line for me is that there are times when you hear genuine concerns, but there are times when you hear something that you know somebody just want to score some unknown political points from something that was well thought through. When I came here, I, I was a deputy minister. Um, I was not in So you charge. know about the project? Of course, I know about it. But you were not the one handling it? Of course. Could it have been managed better? It was managed very well under the previous minister because he did everything right by acceding to the request of the unions.